Okay, so that's it. Um, I forgot to, I forgot to time myself again. I think I was at it for maybe 20 minutes, if that. Um, anyway, I'll let most of it air dry. It's a pretty calm day here in Idaho today. Uh, shouldn't get too much from the air. When you leave the car wet, if it's really windy, you have a lot of particulate matter in the air and it'll settle on the water. I'll go down and I'll wipe my chrome, wipe my windows uh, if it's windy. And my flat surfaces, the hood, because it'll really settle right there. The dirt bike, as you can see, came out perfect. I just let this side of the truck dry in the sun. It's pretty, pretty beautiful day, actually. 80 degrees, feels like. Something in that ballpark. You can see the other side of the truck still a little bit wet. Eh, not bad, just drying. Let's take a quick look and see how much water we used. Not bad. So when I'm washing rigs, I don't conserve water. I just go for it. The more water, the better. Forgot to mention also, nothing but this water touches any of my rigs. I fill my wash bucket with it from start to finish. It's ideal wash water, which is unique. You get about 120 <laughs> or over car washes out of it. I had last system before I changed the polish on this one went a year and a half. I wash a lot of rigs. I've got three more of them and I washed today, including my coach. Time to get ready for show season. This right here is a complete system that'll be going out to a customer later this afternoon. This is the treatment portion of it. Two bases, one has the hose, quick disconnect, and filter wrench for the polish and particular matter filters. And it also flips over to do the RO filter. I have never had one go bad. If you have a customer, and Jeff, you'll be proud of me, I did not do my wheel wells today. I get scolded by a friend of mine when I do my wheel wells uh, and, and with the same brush that I wash my truck with. Thank you. Uh, anyway, comes with a fresh washer. This is an expansion tank. It's got the tank and the interconnect that comes with it. As you saw with my system, I'm running both. And pressure washers, just like anything else, you can you can spend two, three thousand bucks on one. You can go as elaborate as you want. The market that I'm after is an everyday Joe like me that likes having a car wash in his house. I can't tell you how much I enjoy hanging out here and have friends over. We wash cars all the time. Have a beer once in a while. Just just chilling. It is really cool. But I've got quite a few more rigs to wash today, so I'm gonna call it. Uh, any questions, I'm always available. It works. Todd out.